So here it is. Do this better. It actually doesn't fit much, to be honest. Hey guys, so today we're going to check out what actually fits in my Dior mini saddle bag. So this is actually the highest most asked question right after I got my bag is what actually fits. Nowadays the trend is mini micro bags that nothing fits but is cute. Except I'm a little more practical. I like things that are small and cute but so practical. So here it is. I always like storing my luxury bags in their own dust bag. So here is my mini saddle. I'm sure everyone has seen this bag. I also got the straps. Let me just take this off so I can do this better. There we go. The saddle bag actually just comes with this. The strap you buy separately. I think the saddle really looks good in this oblique style. It actually doesn't fit much, to be honest. Honestly, I was too excited at the Dior shop that I didn't really think about that question. It actually does fit my essentials. I have worn it out without having to carry a separate bag. So it has a magnetic closure and the inside just looks like this. Very small. I think the biggest problem with this is the, the shape of it. <laughs> like if it, it wasn't this shape, it would have fit so much more. But I am going to demonstrate the things that I can fit in there. So of course the first thing you want is to fit your phone and it doesn't fit. I have a iPhone 13 Pro Max and it just sticks out like that so you can't close it at all. It will just ruin your bag if you try to close it. But at the same time, you know, I have my phone on my hands pretty much 24-7. Rarely put it in my pocket or my bag. So that was not the huge problem. The biggest problem is I think my wallet is not that big. I have the Moynat envelope wallet. It barely fits. So if you put it in here, it still sticks out. But because the leather is very soft, you can close it. Fine. But it's not great for your wallet because then it kind of folds in and that's not what I want to do with my Moynat wallet. So then a card holder works so much better with this bag because it just slides on the side. It's also like playing Tetris. You have to be really strategic with the order you put things in. So I can put the card holder in here. I have my hand sanitizer essential for the pandemic. This goes right at the very end where the bag is deepest on this side. The next essential thing is tissue. This goes right after the hand sanitizer, like around here. Just completely hides in there. Honestly, this is pretty much the final essential thing that I can fit in this bag is my AirPod Pros. I have a huge case on top of it being pro. So this thing can sh just shove at the very end and it sticks out a little bit but it's fine actually the great thing about this case that I got is that I can just hook it to the side of this bag so you can hook it at the C or the D on the side you can just stick it on the outside of whatever mini miniature bags that you have a better way to do this is to actually just take the case away and then this just slides in right now it looks like that so you can see there's still a little space over here without the airpod case i can first stick a lipstick right next to the tissue like so and then fit the airpod case next to that voila so these are kind of like just the essentials that i need to go out of course i also have my octopus card and my student id this card holder is bigger than the actual cards itself i sometimes put this on the back but again, it sticks out a little bit. Whereas if you put it in the front, it just completely goes in. This is everything that I can fit in my Dior mini saddle bag. It's not exactly very practical. Normally with these size bags, I didn't think much of it because I do have similar size bags. They're just not shaped in this 
saddle shape and it's the saddle shape that causes it to have little problems with fitting stuff in but I really love this bag I don't regret buying it at all it's very classy yet very casual which fits my style if you're someone who is a little more practical your wallet's bigger you have more that you want to bring out then you probably would not be able to fit everything in here you'll probably have to bring another bag which a lot of girls do in Hong Kong anyways so it's not something that's weird so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope it helped you with knowing what actually fits in here and giving you a little advice on whether or not you want to purchase this. I do think this is a very classic Dior style bag. I picked this size because it looked better crossbody and I wanted to wear it crossbody. I will be doing more what fits videos with other bags. So stay tuned for that and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!